This uh, this shopping cart has been here for days. I don't know whose it is, but uh, if you want to come pick it up, it's here at the office. The address is. Here comes the rain. <sighs> I'm on my way to get a smoothie. I've been craving one today for some reason. All right, I got my smoothie. I'm gonna head back to the, well, now it's not raining, so this is what, see the joke is with Florida, it's one of the only states, probably the only state, where you need sunglasses and, a, and an umbrella at the same time. Okay, so like one thing that's like constantly being brought up, well, brought up, kind of just like touched upon while I've been talking, like Parker and Tristan and a few other people, Nick, about like pr production, like content creation as a job, content creation as a hobby, content creation as a whole. And like that is like a lot of people who are like creators, people who just create all the time, their mind's always running, their mind's always doing something. It's something in terms of how do I, like figuring out a problem, like how do I can I get this person to help me with this video, like a problem like that. Sometimes it's more of a technical problem, like this camera's not doing what I want it to do, how can I make it work? Stuff, stuff of the, that variation, stuff like that. And like, th for me, recently, by recently I mean maybe two weeks or so, um, kind of since I announced that I'm like gonna really focus on these vlogs, that was a few episodes ago. Anyways, um, that like I haven't, like my sleep schedule has been off. And like that's a big deal I feel like in terms of production and running a company and everything is like you need the proper amount of sleep in order to, to function throughout the day. And like while I'm like running my company, what I, when I was just focusing on the company, what I would do is I, I would basically go to bed at like midnight to one, wake up at nine and then start my day and repeat that. Um, but what I've been doing more recently is like, I'm still working like 16 hours a day, but my work schedule has, been, has just been like pushed up. So instead of going to bed about midnight or one, I'm really going to bed at like three, four, five in the morning and waking up at around noon. And then, so like, it, it's the same a block of time. It's just getting pushed forward through the day. And I realized that like, I don't know if I'm happy that way. And I feel like, like, I can definitely control that. I can wake up earlier, I can go to bed earlier. But, but like, these vlogs, like what I'm trying to focus on, what I'm trying to build here, um, is what I'm really happy with right now. It's like what I want to do. So I feel like changing, I don't know, I just forgot how to get that out. Like, my sleep schedule has been off recently, so I'm sorry if these vlogs recently haven't been so action-packed oriented or travel-y or whatever, but I've just been trying to find the balance. And it's, it's, it's an experiment right now. So like, today I woke up a little bit earlier than I did in these past few days, and I've noticed that like my creativity is just kind of drained. So I don't like, I don't know, I just felt like I had to say that and not apologize, just inform you guys of what's going on. Um, I just, I just felt like I had to say that. So anyways, um, I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna hang out with Nick later on, but I gotta get some work done before then. So like, I, I think I've mentioned this in a vlog a bunch of times, but I try to be really open in these vlogs about like who my influence are, who I like in terms of on YouTube. One of them is Casey Neistat. Love that guy. Anyways, I saw this in one of his vlogs. Just have to stop here for a second. This is a magical spot and a magical time in all of Manhattan, ready? Okay, so it looks like the sun's coming from there, but then the sun's also coming from there. And this isn't Star Wars, there isn't a planet with two suns. That's the actual sun. And then the way they built this building here, it reflects the sun, but only for like 10 minutes a day. Look how evenly I'm lit. This looks like movie lighting. Does anybody else care about this or is it just like a filmmaker thing? No, Casey. 
it's not just a filmmaker thing. I mean, maybe I'm, I'm a little biased. Anyways, I my sister lives in New York City. What's up? I have a I have a question for you. Mhm. Question is, do you are do you know that spot in New York City where it's they call it like New York City Hedge or something like that? Where it's like the build, it looks like Stonehenge. It's like the, how the buildings are built, and during like sunset, it shows that there's like. Have you ever heard about this? No. <sighs> nope. Obviously, doesn't know where it is. I'm gonna look it up. I know there's a thing called Manhattan Hedge, but I don't think that's what that is. The. These kids again. What? Yo. Yes. Where are you? I'm right here because there's a wall. Hi. You guys want to ride? It's gonna rain. It's dripping. Huh? It's dripping. It's raining now. Hey guys, uh, today's episode is sponsored by Invictus Magic. Whether you're just starting out and you're a beginner, or you're intermediate, or somewhere in the middle, or if you're having like a Las Vegas show and you're a professional and you have a theater named after you. Let Invictus Magic help you. With over 15,000 products in their catalog, you can get everything you need for every single different type of magic and every level of a magician's career. So again, InvictusMagic.com slash John for 20% off your first purchase. Um, you guys can get anything and everything there. Again, InvictusMagic.com slash John for 20% off your first purchase. Uh... What was that? What's up, John? It's the How are you? John. I'm this the other John. This is the other John. Nice to see you. And this is uh, Mackenzie. Yeah, hey, what's up, man? Or were you playing earlier? Uh, no, I was. <laughs> oh, I was like, man, I was really, I was, wasn't expecting that. Dude, your TV went through the dryer. It used to be the whole wall, and now it's. <laughs> what what setting did you put it on? I thought it was. I, th I thought I put it on delicates. Apparently, I put it on bulky. <laughs> <laughs> did you guys do? What was that, bro? Penis. I needed vlog footage, so I'm glad I got it. <laughs> it's y'all's. It's y'all. It's probably Nick. With I didn't smoke anything. Yeah, right. Anything. Hey, you got a plug on you? Uh, what was I? I said. Yeah, I got anything. So I'm here editing the vlog, and I just have to say, I realized I have like a lot more work to do, and it's one o'clock in the morning. So sorry for like the really like random end to this vlog tomorrow should be not as random I said I feel like I say that one like I, anyways tomorrow should not be as much of a random ending but I have to end this episode here so I can anyways I'll see you tomorrow kids on the street you would be we could kick it all weekend baby no sleep speak about whatever till the sun was in the sky swimming naked in the ocean while the sky was falling open hoping you would me on the beach on my back seat listening to rap